In a previous video, this one, we discussed the use of kinematic equations in the analysis of projectile problems. We learned that because the horizontal and the vertical motion are independent of each other, we must use two sets of kinematic equations, one for the horizontal and one for the vertical. And we must take known values of variables and make sure the horizontal values go in the horizontal equations and the vertical values in the vertical equations. No mixing and matching. Now, as we go through this video, we're going to learn a five-step strategy for solving a projectile problem. And the first step is to read the problem and diagram it so you can develop a mental picture of what's going on. The second step is to identify all known variables and to relate them to symbols in the equations. Like you might say, VOX equal 12 meters per second. The third step is to identify the unknown variable. Again, use the corresponding symbol. Like you might say, dy equal question mark. The fourth step is to select your equations to use from among our choices that you see here. And the fifth step is to substitute values into the equation and do your algebra until you arrive at an answer to what the unknown value is.